fans are on their feet. They're waving their green Quaker State towels. They're whipping in the wind. And here is Martin Truex Jr., the outsider of row one, leading them to the green flag, which is flying once again here at Kentucky with a push from Brad Keselowski. Truex, quick break to the outside, will lead the field to one. As they roll into turn one, the defending race track, and Martin Truex Jr. has the advantage, sliding up into the second spot right now. It'll be last week's winner, Eric Jones. They're going to be side by side halfway down the back stretch. Jones challenging for that second. Turns three and four. Jones on the bottom. Truex to the outside. Now Truex gathers it up on the outside, and he'll take the lead. Eric Jones got a bit loose, so he has to fall back on his back bumper. It is Brad Keselowski. Then it's Harvick, Kyle Busch, and Paul Menard. Out to a big, quick lead is going to be Martin Truex Jr. Riding in that second spot, Eric Jones. Brad Keselowski in his tire tracks, holding down third for the moment. The pale blue machine of Kevin Harvick. Best battle on the racetrack right now. We're looking at Paul Menard and Kyle Busch to his outside. Right behind him, Ryan Blaney. Once again, Truex in control up front. The only guy on the outside right now is Kyle Busch. Paul Menard squeezes by to the inside, move him up to fifth. Now Blaney goes after Kyle Busch, and right on Blaney's back bumper, it's Clint Boyer. Eric Almirola now fighting to get around Ricky Stenhouse Jr. That's going to be back there for the 12th spot. Almirola will take that spot away and wrestle it away, continuing to lead down the backstretch. It's Truett, Jones, and Keselowski.